this is Angie with Angie's Crafting with Anne's here on YouTube. Welcome to my channel. It's great to see you again if you've been here before and welcome, welcome, welcome. If you haven't been, please remember that it is free to subscribe and like creators channels. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy this content on your way out and ring the bell to be notified of future videos. Today I have an unboxing of my purchases for Diamond Art Club's fifth anniversary sale. So let's take a look at it. Hey guys, I am back. Somehow I opened my box, da da, dun da da da, and my video camera wasn't recording. Well, it wasn't the video camera, it was me. I forgot to press the button. <laughs> I think I was a little excited to uh, get it open. So the first one I have today is Moon Goddess. It's square, and we'll look at that one. And then I also have Sunflower Garden, which is a round, and I'm looking forward to that one. I love, love chickadees, okay? I just do, I have a soft spot for chickadees. And this one is Golden Poppy Fairy by Hannah Lynn in a round. Awesome. So I'll be right back. So the first one I'm going to open is Sunflower Garden. This is a round kit. And if you haven't seen an unboxing for Diamond Art Club before, they have scan codes on the boxes. There's scan codes on everything. There's instructions on how to diamond paint along the back. So it's pretty comprehensive and everything you need, need to start diamond painting is in here. Plus a little extra, a couple little extras that aren't necessary but nice to have. So let's take a look at that. And this one looks like a super happy kit. This is by the artist Donna Gelsinger. It is a round, like I said, and it's 50.7 centimeters by 68.9 centimeters. And for those of you that are using Imperial, it's 20 by 27 inches. I'll pull this out. There's my sticker and the box. Where's my toolkit? There it is. Go. So here's the sticker. You can put this on the end of your box or in your journal. Whatever you would like to do with it, you could make a collage. You could go wallpaper your wall with it, put stickers everywhere. Anyways, I'm gonna put mine in my journal. When I decide to kit it up, I take a look at the toolkit at the end of the unboxing. So here is the Diamond Art Club sleeve. This is keeps all the dust and things out of the kit while you're not using it. And we will see if I can disconnect the plastic without ripping it. It's so much pressure. Pressure, pressure. Mm. You know what? I'm not gonna rip my rip it this time. I am just going to cut it. Because I've given up. I am not good at this part. I almost always rip them. There we go. So at least then there's not holes in the bag and I could just use scotch tape to pull it back. I think it's better for me. Here we go. Because I'll put it back in its box when we're done. Although I am going to be hitting up something, I just haven't decided what. I'll pull out the drills. And then we'll take a look at Here's our drills. We'll take a look at those in just a minute. We have our sticker sheet. There it is. Isn't that cute? That is so cute. This is, there's the measurements and all the information about the kit that I just read to you. It has a section for your start and end date and then all your pre-cut stickers are here and it looks like we have one, two, three Aurora Borealis drills which is an AB coating drill, and I'll show you those in a few minutes if you haven't seen them before. 
And it always comes with, they fill in the bottom here, which is nice, with these extra stickers down here, which I find quite handy and I use them for kitting up storage and things. So yeah, we have 52 colors. That's awesome. That's going to be fun to take a look at that. And we have our instructions. Here, thank you for your purchase from the founder of the company. Inside are more interactions and more scan codes for discounts in multiple languages and more directions and things that you can order. Yeah, and then there's instructions to join the uh, VIP group in here as well. And a discount for purchasing off your first time purchase for the app. And then, oh yes, there's the VIP group. I was showing you the wrong way around. That's the VIP group instructions that you can join. There's fun things in there. And now let's take a look at this. Oh, look at this. This is so cute. I'm going to roll it backwards. Because it's poured glue, we can do that. This backing is super duper soft and quilty. I just love it. There it is. Let's see. Camera's kind of crooked. That's okay. We can deal with that. So look at all these little birdies. Isn't that so cute? I'm just loving this. Just loving this. And so if you haven't seen this before, Diamond Art Club has a sparkle canvas and the edges are poked and scalloped to prevent fraying. You have a legend going down both sides over here and here. And down at the bottom is all the socials and schematics information, you know, ways to get more information and another, another information for discount codes down here. And then all the artist information, Donna Gelsinger, Diamond Art Club. This is um, Diamond Art Club does license their artists and that is fantastic. And we'll just check the glue. It's like, I've never had a kit with a problem. Sounds good. Feels like good cover, a good cover sheet. And I will show you the drill field is looking crystal clear as usual. Last time I did this, somebody said, go slower, go slower, please. So I will try and go a little slower, but you can see that is crystal clear as expected. And there's the little bird, isn't he cute? Yeah. So let's take a look at the drills. I don't normally uh, read out the colors, but I'm gonna pause it while I remove the outside package. I just wanted to note that the outside of the package is uh, has the kit name on it so that you can you can store your drills and your canvas separately. So here we are taking a look. I'm going to pan through the drills so you can see the colors. This is a really happy kit and it looks quite relaxing to work on. Look at that. Ooh, there's our first bag of ABs, number 130. So Aurora Borealis is a coating on the drills that mimics the Northern Lights in the Northern Hemisphere. And it just adds extra sparkle to an already sparkly drill. It looks really pretty. I bet you that goes in those beautiful sunflowers. Yeah. And I like this color. I always like 3756. I always think it's so pretty. And we've got some nice summer white 3865 yeah great and i think we might have a fairy dust diamond in here actually i have to find it oh there's another little bag of gray i'm gonna guess that goes in the birds isn't that pretty look at that oh that is an amazing, amazing coating, isn't it? Just love it. Some more pretty accent colors for the flowers. It's 
some browns for the middle of the sunflowers. We got a standard bag of white 141, which shows you the best view of the actual, what the coating color is actually like. And you see, you can see it's a rainbowy color. It's quite pretty. So I am on the hunt for those very dusty girls. There they are. It's a bag of green. I wonder where that's going to go. Z165. Well, that looks really, really cool. I hope that, that the camera is focusing and you can see it. Maybe I should open those so you can see them. Do we want to have a look? Maybe what I'll do is I'll open the toolkit and then we can use the tray inside to look at those fairy dust drills. And then we'll look for the ABs. So inside here you have everything you need to diamond paint. You notice that I did not rip the top off because it's resealable, it's a Ziploc bag. We have a sparkle pen with a squishy, there's sparkle in there, with a four placer and a seven placer. And if you don't know how to use a multi-placer, I have a video on my channel in my how to section, which shows you how to diamond paint and how to you to do multi multi-placing. So yeah, and that can be used on areas where, you know, you have so more solid sections of a single symbol. Yeah, so there's that. And we have a roll of washi tape. You can use that to mark off your sections and or the edges of your canvas to prevent uh, pet hair from getting in your glue, which is what I normally do. Um, a lot of people have a lot of uses for washi tape. So it's a nice dark blue one. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. Oh, he's cute. It's a bunny. I haven't seen this one before. I think his tongue is sticking out. This is cute. This is a cover minder. You don't have to have it, but how that works is you take the little magnet off and you put this on the top. It clicks together. You pull back your plastic and you use it to hold back your plastic like this and put the other piece underneath and then you can diamond paint your section. Yeah, oh, he's super cute. Huh. He's going on my collect in my collection on the wall because <laughs> I don't usually use those cover minders. I just like them because they're cute. You have a bag of baggies for kitting up or storage, whatever you need them for. We have Diamond Art Club's heart shaped wax. There are two caddies of wax in here like this, and there is plastic on them, so before you stab your pen in there, please be sure to take off the plastic layer. And this is more than enough for this small sized kit. Small, medium kit, and it's medium. Yeah, there's more than enough in there, that's tons. And then we have our, our, our tray with the stopper, it's removable. It's to help you to not lose drills out the ends when you gently shake your tray back and forth. So I, I love my Diamond Art Club trays, I'm using them all the time actually. So let's take a look at this fairy dust drill. I believe it's a fairy dust drill. It is symbol number S. So we'll take a look at how pretty it is and then I'm gonna find it on canvas when it is pretty. A little piece of something in there, not a big deal. Super shimmery, look at the shimmer on that. Can you see it? It's a really pretty lime color. Yeah, really pretty, very happy. So where do those go? On here, symbol S is highlights in the leaves. Here we go. Highlights in the greenery. Isn't that pretty? Wow. If I kit this up, this one would only take me a couple weeks to do because I have a job. If I didn't have a job, I'd probably do it in a week. 
This is super, super pretty. I am so glad I bought this kit. Look at the pretty flowers up here in the top. And this is like a happy summer, spring, summer day. Wow, I really like it. Just gonna put these away so I don't have a spilling accident and then I don't have them for my kit. I'm gonna put them over to the side here. And then let's take a look at the other two colors which was the yellow 130, 130, and this silver one, which I'm gonna guess is in chickadees. I love chickadees. Chickadees make me happy. They come to my bird feeder all the time, and they are just the happiest little guys and gals popping around doing their thing. So there's our three ABs. So we have number one on the canvas is number 130. Number two is the silver. And number three is the white. So already I can see number threes and number twos in the birdies. Little birdies. Just like little fluff balls. And I can see the 130, which is number one, is all up in these beautiful sunflowers. So the sunflowers are actually a combination of these green fairy dust drills and this yellow. So that is a super pretty kit to work on. Yeah. So choices, choices, choices. I'm looking for my summer kit to take on vacation. Maybe this is it. This has a nice size. It's making me happy. Yeah, really cute. See you on the next one. So the next one I'm going to be unboxing today is Moon Goddess. This is by Eau Claire Studio. It is a square and you can tell by the blue square on the outside. And again, you have your scan codes and your instructions on how to diamond paint on the back. So there we are for that. This box came a little squished, but it's okay, because the inside isn't breakable. You know, it's not fine china. But uh, let's take a look. Just cut the end. I'm really excited to look at this one. The design of this reminds me quite a bit of um, the Josephine Wall kits that Diamond Art Club used to have licensed. So, and of course I just love fantasy and all of that. So it looks really great. There's that canvas. Toolkit. sticker with the art on it. And we'll look at the toolkit after. So here's the sleeve. Now should I try to open this? No, nope, it's going to rip. So I'm going to cut it instead of ripping it. Yeah, no. Nope. It would be nice if it would be more. I find another way to seal the bags. <laughs> but they're always working on improvements. Maybe one day that will happen. They're kind of a fickle thing, aren't they? Bags. There's the insides. So here's the drill package. Lots of interesting things in there. And it's marked again so that you can store it separate separately from your uh, canvas if you want to and of course we have the instructions that we looked at earlier so I'll just put those to the side 
but wow, we have two pages of stickers here. So you have like a bonus piece of artwork here that you could put in your journal or something. And again, marking it with your start and end date. This is square and it's 22 by 33 inches or 56 by 84 centimeters. And we have 68 colors. And by looking at this, we have one, two, three, four AB drills. ABs are anything under 150 and the Diamond Dark Club uh, method of symbols. And there's a special drill here at the end. It's Z3865 and it's a dot. So we'll have to see which one that is. Isn't she beautiful though? She really is stunning. Okay. Let's get the drills out of the way. And I'm just going to quickly roll this inside out so I can flip it back quickly. You can get a good look without it. Again, cord glue so you can roll it backwards and it won't hurt it. Just give it a little hold there for a minute. A couple seconds. Boom! There she is. Let's zoom out maybe just a touch. Move my camera a little. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. You can see all of her. Isn't this beautiful? Noon goddess. And we have the legends down both sides. The drill field is clear. Not seeing any issues there, of course. We have all the information on the bottom. Along with the Facebook groups and social media and all the things. Wow, look at her. Isn't she stunning? I wonder if she, yeah, she's a moon goddess, you guys. She's in the moon. She's overlooking something over here. I'm not sure what. But this is, uh, there's quite a bit of color blocking in here, actually. I expected it to be more heavier confetti than this. This is sort of medium. There's some sections down here. And it just doesn't look too bad. This whole area over here looks pretty easy to work on and I think you could really her jewelry here would is going to look really great look at her earring that's fabulous okay well, let's take a quick look at the toolkit and then we'll look at the drills I'll just I'm not going to show you I'll just show you what's in here I'm not going to explain it all because you saw me explain it for the round kit because it's a square kit there will be a set of tweezers in here and this kit is coming with all of the other same things here you have your washi tape your little uh, <laughs> cover minder it's a little little cookie and yeah so I and an orange pen now these are completely random so when they print this again, I know this kit is out of stock. More than likely, it'll come with a completely different toolkit. I mean, the contents will be the same, but the colors will be different. The washi tape will be different. The magnet will likely be different because they are random. Yeah. I believe this one sold out really fast. And you can see why. Isn't she fantastic? She is fantastic. So let's take a look at the drills. I'm just going to pause it while I open this. So I was just laying this out and I just noticed that a bag has come apart. It looks like it's a dark blue AB. So I have to just, is it this one? Yep, this bag is cut. I'm not sure why. I just was laying things out so I don't want to lose any of those so I am going to put some scotch tape on that bag to make sure it stops releasing drills 
So I always want to show what's happening, you guys. Make sure you know about it. Use them honest here. Let you know what's really happening. So there's that. So that is now secure for the moment. And I am going to pick these up so we don't lose them. But look at how pretty they are. They're really, really pretty. Some ladies. I'm just going to set them over on the side. And then when we get to it, I'm going to put that bag of babies into a second baggie. Or is it this one that's open? Oh, there's another dark blue one. No, it's not. So this kit comes with four ABs. This is symbol number two. This is number 106. Then it happened to be by itself. Isn't that beautiful? This must be in the moon. And it is symbol number two. And I can see that all the way through here just by looking at its inner jewelry. Really pretty. Put that to the side. So here's our accent colors. There's a little bit of a number 101. We'll see where that goes. And a 121. We'll see where that goes. That's a dark purple. That's really pretty. And I don't I don't read out all the codes. There's the bag that broke open, but it looks like it was like six, you know, a dozen drills maybe that came out, so it's okay. And there's none in the dust cover, so nothing was lost. That's a good thing. That's a pretty color here on the end. Yeah. Do do do. Here we go. Quite a nice palette. I'm gonna need a lot of darks though. So I'm not sure when I'll work on this. I have to think about it. Right now I'm in the mood for summer. This is the last one. It's a big bag of this. What is this at the end? Is that the same? Oh no, that's 317 dark gray. Wow, we have quite a few bags of black. For me, at least, I don't normally order kits with too much black. So one, two, three, four, five, six bags of 310. And they're fat ones. But, you know, I'm looking at this and I just don't see. Well, I guess there's some multi-placing up here, but it just doesn't look like six bags worth. Maybe they've just given us lots of extra. Interesting. And then there's three bags of dark blue, 939. Okay. So that means there are nine bags of super dark drills. And I, but the moon is taking up so much space, though. It doesn't look like it's a big enough kit to have all these dark colors, like as many as bags that are in here. There's more dark blues. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not convinced that there's six bags of 310 in here. It doesn't look like it's me. So let's just have a look where some of these ABs are going to go. Um, so number one was like a bluey gray AB. And let's see if we can find that. So where is that bluey gray AB? Hmm. It's a number one. It's got to be down in here somewhere. There it is. Sort of out in the universe. Sprinkled in. Here you go. And this is actually a really good opportunity to use quad cubes here. See this little square here? And you could put in a couple in and around in here. That would be super fun. That's probably what I'll do. And then these number twos is this. Really pretty. Sort of a dark cream. It's really nice. I actually really like this one. I don't think I've had this one before. And they're all along her face. So it must be like reflecting the moon onto her face because she's the moon goddess. 
So that's fun. And it's all in her jewelry here and on the edge of this pretty looking rose and all in her, her headpiece as well. Wow, this is a cool kit. The next one is 121 and 136. It's a dark, 121's the dark purple we looked at. It's number three. And I can see it's here in the flowers here. And it's just sprinkled in in a couple places. There's some more down here. It's just in, it's just, yeah, there's some more here for the dark purple AB and in here. So it's just mixed in here and there. And number four, is the bag that I think that broken. It's number 136. It's a dark blue here that we just looked at. Can you see that one? Let me check. Yeah, you can see that one's really pretty. So that one in is number four, you are hiding from me. You must be sprinkled in with the number threes. That is what I'm thinking, because it's not in it's not in the moon goddess. It's got to be in the background. Here we are. All here, all this dark blue area has blue babies and to it into this sort of Milky Way atmosphere space look. So that's moon goddess. Isn't she beautiful? I'm just not exactly sure when I'm going to be working on her. I. I'm just finishing a Josephine Wool kit, a uh, bubble flower right now. And I also have, and I have another Max Color kit kitted up. So probably when those are done, I may kit this one up next. She's just gorgeous. And there's so many opportunities to add more crystal and things. And there's so much that has already come with it. It'll be interesting to see how it works up. So yeah, let's take a look at the next one. So this is Golden Poppy Fairy by the artist Hannah Lynn. It is a round. It is 43 centimeters by 61 centimeters rounded up or 17 by 24 inches for those of you using Imperial. Isn't she super cute? Let's take a look at her. Where is my box cutter? Take a look at the end. Here, this was a new release for the anniversary sale. I believe she's out of stock, but I'm pretty sure they almost always would bring Hannah Lynn's back, wouldn't they? We got in here, got our toolkit and our sticker. There's the sticker to put on the end for storage or in your journal. And we have our toolkit. Take a look at that in a few minutes. Then we have our diamond painting in the sleeve. Ooh, I got lucky. It didn't rip and I didn't have to cut it. I just have bad luck with bags. <laughs> it's just the way it is, right? Bad luck with the bags. This should be a super cute small kit. There's your instructions and your how-to, your scan codes, and your VIP joining information with the scan code. Yeah, that's super awesome. And here's the sticker sheet. Ooh, 55 colors. And let's see, one, two, three, four, five ABs. That's quite a few. And the Golden Poppy Fairy by Hannah Lynn. And she just looks so summery. She even has freckles. Oh, so cute. And here's our happy bag of trills. It's nice and small. And it's marked with the kit name Golden Poppy Fairy. Take a look at that in a few minutes. I'm going to just wind her backwards so that she will flip right out easily. Look. Do, 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 do. Here she is. Oh, isn't she cute? She is super cute. I'm just going to move my camera, get a better look. 
It's dark outside today. Actually, that's why I'm filming, because it's dark outside today. Because <laughs> it's been too hot. It's only June, but it's been unreasonably, unseasonably warm here where I am. I'm in Canada. So, yeah. Whoops. Bumped my camera. That's better. It'll just flatten out itself, but I just kind of didn't want it curling up while we were looking at it. The drill field is perfectly clear. You can see that. Look at her pretty face. Yes, she's a big eyed girl. That's for sure. But I really like all these nice colorful flowers. At the bottom we have all the information and the socials. We have our double sided legend and our sparkly canvas. Just to add more sparkle, right? Let's check the glue. Of course it's good. <laughs> she even has a belly button. That's really cute. Really cute. This makes me want to go on summer holidays. So cute. So let's take a look at the toolkit. And you don't have to rip the bag because it is resealable. And this is a round toolkit. So it does not have tweezers in it. So in here we have a green pan and squishy and a four and seven placer. Of course the kits are the tool kits are always random, right? So you never know what you're gonna get if they do another reprint. We have washi tape, we have the dual caddy of wax. Let's take a look there. Don't forget to take the plastic off. It's more than plenty uh, wax to do this this size of kit but they always come with two pieces oh look at this little cover minder it's a little bunny with a strawberry isn't that super cute if you don't know how to use a cover minder you take the extra little magnet off and then you pull back your plastic and you can put this here and it holds your plastic back while you're working on your section. And we have our tray, Diamond Art Club tray. You just shake it gently, the stopper comes out. This prevents the drills from coming out the end while you're shaking it. And we also have a bag of baggies for storage or whatever you might need them for. So yeah, that's great. So here's the drill package, and I'm just gonna pause it and take the drills out of the package to avoid extra crinkling. So, wow, there are a lot of colors here, you guys. Let's walk through the colors and see what we can see. Just take a look at what's in here. There's the white AB, super pretty. There's a little bit of everything in here. Lots of little tastes of color, like that can't be more than, what is that, 100 drills? The green, some of these are pretty small accent colors. Sorry about the sirens. Okay, so we'll take another look at the rest of the drills. Lots of pretty summer colors in here. Super cute. This kit isn't very big. It would be great for traveling or just a, a quick finish to work on something and pop it out, you know. There are one, two, three, four bags of black because there's black outlines in here. And oh, this must be her skin color. So I can see lots of color blocking in this kit, in my opinion. And there's her, her poppy skirt colors. Those are happy, happy, happy. Lots of yellow. Ooh, and a really nice bag of 131 AB. That's super pretty. Ooh, and I love 114 ABs. Aren't those pretty? Oh, and we have green ABs. Nice. Must be, well, we'll see where they go in just a sec. Awesome. Great colors. So let's take a look where those go. So 
on the legend, we can see that we have number one, number two, three, and four, and the dot are all ABs. So anywhere we see a dot is a white AB, and they are just sprinkled throughout. And here you can see, and I have three dogs in my house, so it's almost, an, it's almost unavoidable that someone would bark when I'm recording. <laughs> so you can see they're all sprinkled in here, just like little highlights, and they're in, their, in her eyes. And the other symbols I can see right away is number three, AB green, is all in her hair in here, all here. That's cool. And I see number four ABs in, under her eyes, in her irises, and in some of these highlights down here. And of course, in her skirt, I see lots of number four ABs. And number two red ABs are also in the flowers on her top and in her skirt in the center section. And where did the number three green ABs go? Oh yes, we said they were in her hair, but I see some over here as well. So that is just a super cute kit, super fun for summer. So that's the unboxings for today. Please like and subscribe on your way out. This is Angie wishing you a really good week. Please let me know what you're working on in the comments below and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.